Spring is high time for baby showers and bridal showers and a good charcuterie board. It's a shower staple by now, but it's not just about throwing the meat and cheese on a block of wood. A refined look is all about those dainty little details. Charcuterie artist Megan Rich has perfected the beautiful and balanced board. We are in awe of your art sister. Thank that you. is amazing. Thank you for being here. I'm so excited to be here. And agreeing to share some of your tips and tricks. You say a charcuterie board is an instant party pleaser. It is. I think if you're gonna eat, it might as well look good. <laughs> and you eat with your eyes true, first. True, true. A good charcuterie board does start with the actual board. Where yes. are you sourcing your favorite? So, you can find them almost anywhere right now, but my favorite place to go is actually Ross. Ross? Yes, fraction of the cost. Same quality boards, food safe, beautiful pieces, half of what you get okay. at Target, TJ Maxx. I wouldn't have thought of that, putting it on the list. Uh, you've got a charcuterie checklist I that do. you've assembled for us to help us nail the perfect board. What are your go-tos? Okay, so start with your cheeses. You want a, an assortment of cheeses, some hard, some soft. Okay. It's a little bit for everyone. And then I also think you need um, something savory, something sweet. Okay. Some sort of a carb, a bread or a cracker to help make those pairings. We need sustenance. Yes, yeah. you do. Yeah. It's, it's a requirement. And then something pretty. You want it to look good with those fillers to fill in your holes, little things. But really, it's not a board if it if it isn't a little bit wowing to the it's eyes. It's gotta be beautiful. What are your favorite fillers? Do you have a few? So I like like a good nut, a, a good nut. candied yeah. nut or okay. chocolate. Kind of fill that something sweet and filler. Dried fruits okay. are often used as a filler. There's a few sculptures, I'll call them. Little artistic Great. moments on your board that you're gonna show us. First I is am. the salami flour. You say we can do this two ways. Yes, got two different um, methods for you here. The first one's gonna use one of these little um, condiment cups. Okay. Buy them anywhere. I bought these ones at Walmart. You're gonna take your little two ounce Can condiment cup. I do this cup. with you? I'm gonna try. Absolutely. I don't know why do. I set myself up for this, but here we go. We're gonna use this um, Columbus dry salami, the smaller one. Okay. And we're gonna start by just putting a couple of pieces right around our edge here. Okay. Like three? Three. Four? Yeah. Three? Okay. I like things in odds. Okay. One good. pro tip for your board. I good, like things good, in good. odds. Then I'm gonna take just a few pieces and lay them all out here next to each other. Okay. How did you get into this to begin with? I started back at Thanksgiving time making turkeys out of vegetables, out of our family relish tray. Oh my goodness. It kind of took off from there. Oh my gosh, so you're folding it kind of on the vertical them, yep, line. Okay. Fold them in half uh -huh. and then you're gonna roll. Okay, and roll from the side. Yep. Roll, okay. roll, roll. And then if you didn't have these little cups, you could take a toothpick and stick it through there. But okay, because we have a little you. cup, we're gonna shove it into the middle okay. and kind of fan things out. Beautiful, what's the second way? The second way, we're actually gonna use glasses. And the different size of your glasses here are gonna help change up the style mm -hmm. of um, your salami or pepperoni. This is actually the charcuterie of a charcuterie board. Charcuterie is a French word, it means cooked cold meat. Oh, okay. But what we have over um, in the display would be more classified as a grazing board because oh, we broke you. some rules, adding okay. a few extra things. So we graze. Yes, and but charcuterie, to... this is the charcuterie. With the meat. Prosciutto, salami, pepperoni. If I, that, I forgot that. Okay, so wrapping the glass the yep. same way we wrap the little cup. Yep, I'm just going to over put it halfway, uh -huh. kind of tucking it in here. Uh huh. And then if you wanted a different look, this one was made with that smaller opening. Look how amazing. And, and then, it kind of holds form. It kind of holds does. shape for you. You're going to flip it upside down. Oh, stop. <gasps> That's the gasp out loud moment. And That's then beautiful. you can, you don't have to even just do meat. There's some oh, cheese provolone. Too. A cheese. A cheese flour. Okay, about a minute left. Can you show us the zigzag Absolutely. Let technique? me do that quickly for you. I'm seeing that in a lot of your fruits here. It does add that little wow factor. Okay, we're going to go alternating up. Uh-huh. And down, and think about cutting the top off of your pumpkin. Okay. At um, oh, Halloween yeah. time. Yeah. And for time's sake, I can show you this one I already have done right but here. But you keep going all the way around. All the way around. Uh huh. And then you'll open it up. Look at that. Did the same on a cantaloupe here. Beautiful. The same on a blood orange. Oh, with the red, the contrast with the orange and the red. Lovely. Uh, what are you loving most for springboards? Is there anything? 
floral, think bright colors, think turning these things, different things into flowers like we did with that salami. Yeah, the oranges. Do. With an orange. Cute. With a cucumber. Cute. With dried mangoes. Oh, I could just stare at this all Bring day. Bring in the flowers. But Bring then, the but then the eat, the eat part comes into view and we Have think to. that we want to do that too. Yeah. You're so good at this, Megan. Thank you for teaching us. Thank you for having me. Where can we see more of your work and more of your beautiful boards? Instagram, Megan Rich underscore does boards and more. All right, we will link you there from our website so you can learn and look. And you take orders too? I do. Okay, good to know. We'll link you over. Thanks again. Great, thank you so much.